That's my stock portfolio today, guys. So <laughs> not the best day in the world, but I hope we are all having a great day today. Um, with the video, so I assume you gentlemen sleep because it's something humans should be doing. You know, otherwise you die. But when we wake up in the morning, what's the main thing that happens? We want to go back to sleep. The alarm has taken us out of the fluffy dream clouds and brought us into the hard, cold, harsh reality. What the most of us do? And we're like, oh, this is too hard because we don't have anything that we need to wake up to that's important. And we just hit this news button. Further prolonging all the important things we probably have to do that day because we don't really want to do them. We're too groggy and tired. Luckily, there is a solution, guys. You know me, I'm a solution man. I don't leave you with the problems. And the solution is a resistance remover, similar to the Pomodoro technique, called the five second rule. And now it's not the one where you drop the food in the ground and it's good if you pick it up before the five second ends. Although I do roll by that rule, I really enjoy that rule. Boosts the immune system, gets you free food when your friends drop it because they're too afraid to pick it up. I'm sure I'm not dead yet. But the other five second rule, which we'll be using, is great. Essentially, the psychology it follows in my eyes is, you know, when you're on these uh, shopping sites like Amazon. Amazon doesn't have it, but Elijah Long, you have it on your website. And it's got a countdown. It's like 50% off. It's like counting down. It's like, and it expires in 10 minutes. And you're like, oh crap, boys, get my credit card out. Shh, shh. Quick, bye bye. Oh, five minutes. Oh. And you've bought the item. You have that sense of urgency. Urgency. Something's behind you. Something's, someone's lighting the fire underneath your ass. Because it's counting down. Your brain's like, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. I'm gonna lose something here. You want to apply the same thing when you're waking up. In your mind, you're gonna be like, oh, I should really wake up because I know it'll be good for my health. It'll get me out, I can start working on my project, get the day rolling, because you're never going to get anything done if you're just asleep in bed all the time, guys. So you want to think in your head, as I was saying, I'm going to get up now. And you're going to start counting down from five, four, three, two, and one. And on one, you're going <laughs> to explode out of bed, throw those covers off you as far as you can, and jump straight onto the ground in your undies, guys. Feel that cold, nice air on you, and you will be awake. You've just beaten resistance there, guys, by using the five second rule. And it's not over yet. In the morning, I have to use the five second rule many, many times. Just before I'm going out for the run, I'm, I'm standing there looking at the shoes, and I'm like, don't really want to go. I've got my mise en place, the shoes are all laid out, all ready to go. I'm already wearing my running gear because I had it on my bed. But I'm like, oh, it's a bit cold outside, a bit tired, I don't want to go. But what do I do? I go five, four, three, two, one, lift off, and then you put the shoes on and you're out the door. It basically tricks your brain into making this into making the decision. It stops your brain from overthinking, guys. You know, planning by paralysis. We paralysis by planning, overthinking things. And when you have a when a decision pops into your mind, guys, and you don't make a decision after five seconds, most likely you're just gonna start overthinking it about it, procrastinating. And that's what the five second rule is meant to eliminate, guys. Just think of it like a rocket, guys. Once they turn that switch, five, four, three, two, one, it's either gonna lift off or it's not going to lift off. The rocket's gonna go. Use it when you're having your cold showers, guys. You know, you know when you're staring at the the shower head above you, and you're like, "Ooh, this is gonna be a painful two minutes." And you're like, and I'm like five, four, three, two, one. I hit the timer. It just hits you, but after it, you feel great. Use the five second rule, guys. You're feeling resistance. You, you think you really should be doing something. You're like, "Oh, I should really be going for this run. Oh, I should really should go to the gym." Start on five, four, three, two, one, and then 
you'll be out the door, you'll be doing the stuff. Hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it as always. Subscribe, like, all the like. I'll see you in the guys another time. Peace.